and my name is Dallas Knowles. I'm the head coach of the Exuma Sailing Club. Next year we're going to be celebrating our 10 year anniversary and basically the whole purpose of our club is to get the young men and women of Exuma involved in the sport of sailing. We like to teach a lot of discipline, teamwork, sportsmanship and we like to hold consistent regattas and practices throughout the year so the kids have something that they feel like they're a part of, a team that they can help support and work towards and they can represent Exuma around the Bahamas at different regattas throughout the country. So we've uh, hosted our own little annual sailing club regatta. We've done our fourth one this year in 2022. Even during COVID, we managed to pull off the event just barely. So we've had a consistent four years of a small local regatta here in Exuma with the Sunfish and the Opti class and the E-class sloops. So uh, instead of the C-class events, which we have throughout the year all over the island, we've uh, tried to focus a little more on the younger kids and the junior classes, some of the international Olympic classes. Uh, so we host that regatta generally around March and April every year. Um, so we're able to do that. We've also gotten involved in the sloop sailing. We bought uh, Termite, a C-class sloop in 2015 with the help of the Exuma community. We raised money to buy that boat from Staniel Key and we put some of the kids on that, some of the uh, high school kids. They sail against the other C-class sailors at the Baratari, Rollville, National Family Island Regatta, Bull Ridge Regatta, Farmer's Key, uh, Long Island. Throughout the whole Bahamas, we take that boat around and campaign it as part of the sailing club. So we compete in both the adult sloop festivals as well as our own regatta. And then we just do a lot of practices and fundraising and have a lot of fun on the water with the kids on a weekly basis. We are actually going to be closing out the youth month uh, this coming weekend with a fall regatta right here in Georgetown, Exuma. Uh, we actually were going to host that event before we even knew about the youth month just because we have so many new sailors and we wanted them to have a chance to compete and not have to wait until next year, March or April, for their first event. So we're going to put on a little regatta for them. It's just going to be a small thing. Uh, and then uh, the administrator approached me and said they would like to feature the event or include the event in the, uh, the entire month of focusing on the youth here at Exuma. So we're now turning it into kind of the culmination of the whole month. We have kids joining us from Staniel Key, Black Point, and Farmer's Key this weekend for the first time. So they're going to come down and compete with us. So it's an all Exuma sailing event and we're going to feature the newer kids that just joined the club in the summer so this will be kind of their first official competition and we're going to have them at uh, front and center they're going to have their own trophies and uh, we should have three days of beautiful racing this weekend in georgetown we're always trying to think ahead not too far ahead but uh, at least in the next you know year or two we would love to have uh, this piece of property here right now we're uh, we're using public land for the club uh, we'd love to have some land right up in the back here where we can put a proper clubhouse down and we can host uh, bigger events and we can be more comfortable. We can have um, a shed to build boats. We can get the kids involved in building sloop sailing boats. Uh, so we'd like to have more of a permanent home. Uh, we've been doing it for 10 years now. We've been kind of jumping around wherever we can find space, but we've gotten too big now where there's only a few places that can really hold the club because it's gotten so big. So we'd love to have a permanent home. Um, another thing I'd like to have for the club, I'd love to have an A-class sloop so we can have an A-class in Georgetown, Great Exuma, which uh, has not had one in a very long time. Um, we host the biggest event, the biggest sailing event of the year in April, and we don't even have an A-class boat to call our own. So I would love to take care of that solution and actually have the kids on it and have the, the junior sailors sailing an A-class at the National Family Island Regatta. That's uh, definitely a, a, a goal that we want to try to accomplish in the next couple of years.